bus driver, a position of ultimate trust. And he violated that trust by touching kids where he shouldn't. You'd think that might be a good bet that the judge would come down hard when the driver came up for sentencing today. That's a bet you would lose. Here's News 13's Nancy Laughlin. Dick 55 year old Martin Gonzalez faced his victims and their parents in court this afternoon. He tearfully apologized and then he walked right out of that courtroom. Martin Gonzalez holds his hands behind his back in court, the same hands he used to touch a little girl's private parts while she was on the Santa Fe school bus he was driving. If a person has the ability to do something as awful as this, that he knows is wrong. He is capable of much more. He confessed to grabbing the thighs of two 13 year olds and touching the crotch of a third grader. In May 2011, one of his mid school victims used her cell phone to record Gonzalez touching another child on the bus. The recording that she took um, afterwards, she had bad dreams all the time. She was terrified that he was going to find her and retaliate against her and hurt her. Gonzalez said he didn't want to put the girls through a trial, so he pled guilty to his crimes, then today begged for forgiveness during his sentencing. I can see that anger in you, please. Tell your kids I'm so sorry, and please forgive me. Because I said I'm not a bad person, I just made a big mistake. I just hope that all of you could just please forgive me. For what I've done, I would never have ever harmed them again at all. Any any kids, I, I just want to get help. The district attorney and the victims want to judge Mary Marlowe Summer to give Gonzalez the maximum sentence of six years in prison. Instead, she gave him probation with the GPS monitor, made him register as a sex offender, and spend six months in a sex offender treatment program. Mr. Gonzalez, you get to walk out of here today. What do you think about that? I don't think he wants to give a statement. He walked out of the courtroom and out of the courthouse. And the judge did suspend his sentence, meaning if he screws up, she can throw him in prison. Back to you. All right, Nancy, the DA says when the investigation of this case started, Gonzalez admitted touching other girls inappropriately in the past, and he said he had gone through treatment before.